Egyptian smallholders may have a major role in feeding the country's 103 million population. They're struggling to survive. Many say they're facing difficulties to sell their harvests on markets and end up being cash-trapped and indebted, such as Zakaria, who grows onions in the north of the country. Farmers are dead, especially small farmers, as we aren't able to buy anything nor sell our crops. How can the farmer pay his land's rental fees and also eat or drink? With the sharp surge in global prices due to the pandemic and worsened by the war in Ukraine, several farmers can no longer pay water bills or pesticides. The machine pump can take up to a full day to irrigate the small plot of land and consumes two cans of gas that cost about 15 euros. Some farmers have abandoned their lands. They neither sold nor planted them. They don't know what to do with them. They've lost profits over the course of many years. They make no profit at all. The lack of unions and cooperatives in order to help farmers face challenges and understand the system is a problem Yusen Abu Bakar has a solution for. The entrepreneur funded a company offering smallholders agronomy support. Egypt is facing problems related to food, food security, water consumption and shortage, as well as problems related to employment and financial inclusion. The solution to all these issues is working with small farmers. According to the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization, small farms cultivating less than three acres of land produce some 47% of Egypt's field crops.